Hey, welcome back. So there's something I want to talk about. And it's the admins. Now, I will say, almost every server I've ever been on has had perfectly fine admins. But sometimes you run into some that just fit the saying. And the saying is, whenever you give someone power, there's always the potential for abuse. And this one is no different. Now, I've had way worse admins. I was on an Aussie server one time, and they let, like, I can't even remember, six people on as admins, and they were all using the Archon control to uh, team kill with the admin powers so that they could push in and cap the last point on Kursk. This was an issue. These four people, or six people, I can't remember, were removed from their admin privileges. It was a real fucking problem. But this one is something that really drives me crazy. In this clip we're going to watch, I had cleared out the entire church, and we finally started capping. This was like 15 minutes into the match, and... You know, we've been having a hell of a time trying to get this church, and I finally get in there and try to make something happen. And I'm in the middle of taking down some some ammo and some rocket ammo, grenade ammo. And I didn't know it was the admin at the time, but I definitely knew he was part of this clan. But he comes around the corner and team kills me. Now, I don't know about you, but usually there's a blueberry above their head. And sure, I've accidentally team killed people. I've been shot while trying to throw a grenade and it lands at my feet. And, you know, there's a lot of things going on. So I totally understand. And some of you might think, you know, oh, this really isn't a big deal. It happens all the time. But in my opinion, when you rent out a server and you accidentally team kill someone, you can show who the... the you know, more honorable person is by saying, hey, I'm fucking sorry. It's simple. It's like as simple as holding the door for someone, which doesn't seem to happen all that often these days. But, you know, sometimes I like to jump into a higher ping, play on a Dutch server or something, you know, and just see what's going on because every server seems to play this game a little bit differently. But I, I will say that I did finish the game with more points than anybody on both sides, which... Happens, but it doesn't happen all that often. But it's pretty goddamn funny because when I get into rage mode and I'm actually irritated, then I seem to play a little better. <laughs> I don't know if you guys are the same way, but that, it's, it's just like always been a part of me. But other than that, guys, hope you have a great day. Uh, I, I did just hit 3,000 hours <laughs> in Hell Let Loose, and uh, I'll be showing that clip because something kind of funny happened at the end, too. I was trying to get to 339. That was like my mark. 340 was my big goal. But, uh, you know, I was really hoping for 339 at a minimum. Wasn't going to happen, especially after <laughs> the match that put me over. But other than that, guys, have a great weekend. See ya. This is probably a bad idea. So whatever's back down that road is fucking with the MG. Taylor Hanks taking that job. Hey, cemetery's going. Whoever dies, just jump back there until we pull it. You got no one to fight. It's all clear in here, dude. Come on in. I'm dead, buddy. I'm dead. I'm hopping back to cemetery. 